Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Eternal Flames. My name is Blaze, and welcome to a tutorial I should not have to be doing. Bethesda, you goofed pretty bad. So first off, we're going to talk about what's going on and all that, and I'm going to have some footage kind of just magically pop up. Some really, really bad footage. But uh, while that footage pops up, basically all those little dust clouds that you're seeing like all over the screen... Those are causing the problems. But to make things even more interesting, it's every single dust cloud that is popping up in the level that happens to be in front of you. Which means technically even ones that you can't see, so long as they are in your line of view, are actually trying to be rendered by your computer right this moment. Congratulations. Now, the problem for this is the lighting and shadows, but let, let's get to how to fix that in-game in just a moment. A couple of you are probably having a couple other FPS issues. So, now that we're back on my screen, let's go ahead and go over a couple things that you can do to help. First off, some of your GPUs or graphics cards aren't working. I happen to have NVIDIA, but if you have an AMD, be sure to do uh, essentially what is this um, in your preferences as to how AMD cards work no idea never used one ha! but I'm pretty sure there are somewhere in your settings that will be the same open your control panel and in your control panel you're gonna have pretty much some options in your 3d settings go to 3d management okay just got or uh, no, not 3D management. Configure surrounding 3D physics. For me, I've got this little setup because I have a GeForce 960. Now, for the record, there are two jackasses who went ahead and made some comments in a forum post who were making fun of the GeForce 960 and other stuff like that. For those of us who do not have money, we're sorry that we can't get a better setup, but this is a shout out to you two because guess what? I'm about to fix a problem and your dumbasses who bought something for more money are nothing but assholes. Good on you two. Okay, moving on. What you wanna do is go to your PhysX settings. And for this, you need to set your processor to your GPU. Most of the time, it'll be set to auto select, which is recommended. This means that it'll either use your CPU or your GPU. You need it to be GPU selected for this. The reason being is for some reason, your computer is trying to render all these effects through your CPU. And if you're like me, who has a i5, your CPU cannot take that kind of pressure. Especially if you are recording. Congratulations, you really just crapped on your computer. Now that you've done that, the next thing you want to do is load up Doom. Let's go ahead and do that right now. And I will see you guys here in just a second. Okay, now I've actually got Doom loaded. I can actually, you know, kind of bring this up on screen. And uh, actually show you guys real quick. Let's just go over to Doom. And click on that. Boom. There's Doom. Back to full screen. And we got this again. Alright. So here's the skivvy. In your task manager, which, for the record, if you need to open, go down to your taskbar, right click, and the option is right here. This includes on Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 10. Okay, this also Vista. Right click on Doom. Now if you're on Windows 10, like I am, you're gonna have to go, hit go to details. If you're on Windows 7, all you need to do is select Doom X64 and click set priority. Your computer, once again, for some unknown reason at times, is going to attempt to set this to low or below normal. I don't know what's going on there, but to help with your processes, click either above normal or high. Never click real time. This will screw you really bad. But if you click these, make sure that you have nothing running in the background. Which means, uh, keep your Google Chrome off, boys and girls. You can watch your porn later. I'm going to hit above normal just for the sake of, uh, argument here. And then we're going to close out a task manager. Okay, now that we've done that, now comes the fun part. Back into Doom. 
Now we're back in Doom. Let's select a mission. This is where things are going to get kind of obnoxious. First off, pick a level, okay? If you're just playing through and you're running into troubles, then you're really going to love this one. So, we're going to go ahead and pick the foundry. Now I've picked the foundry, it's going to load up, and you notice I'm at a clean 60 frames per second. And yeah, my frames per second are going to jump and drag depending on what effects are in the local area. But remember that dust cloud that I showed you earlier? Yeah, there's a lot of it here in the foundry, which is perfect for the visual testing. So, we're going to go ahead and do ourselves a favor, and just for the shits and giggles of it, I'm going to go ahead and do you guys a favor and kind of turn off in-game sound. So, we'll hit resume, we'll go forward, and right now I'm running at 60 frames per second. Now, why am I running at 60 frames per second when I just talked about all those dust clouds? Well, first off, I just changed my priorities, but watch my frames per second here in just a second. We'll go to settings, we'll go to video, or actually advanced, and we gotta set these things to ultra. Now, for the sake of argument, I have mine mostly set to medium, but once again, we'll, uh, we'll do ultra, okay? We'll hit yes. And my frame rate is going to tank it. Look at that. Now I'm still running above 30, which is pretty good. You guys could run as low as 10 frames per second. I don't care what anybody says. 10 frames per second is absolute asinine. But once again, frame rate has dropped significantly. To improve frame rate from that 10 to 20, which if you notice, it's dropping hardcore right now. Like, it's seriously dropping. So, how do we fix this again? Let's go back over here. Dodge Mr. Wonkum's there. And go back to settings. Now, if we go back to video. And we, or I keep hitting video. We'll set this to low. Save settings. You'll probably notice that uh, my frame rate has not improved, right? Well, here's another interesting thing. If I Alt Tab, right, and I, I literally just Alt Tabbed, my computer has frozen the screen for you temporarily. Go back in. I'm now running about 60 frames per second. Now I've V-Sync on, so it's trying desperately to stay at 60 frames per second. But look at that. That is just effing beautiful. Okay. Now, once again, to prove my point, we're going to go back into settings. We're going to go back into advanced. We're going to go back to medium. Just medium, right? And look at that. The frame rate drop is insane. Now, a couple of you going, well, when you look certain ways, it seems like it works just fine. Once again, let me point out the obvious thing that I pointed out. The dust particle effect that is happening, specifically these effects right here, like these effects that are used in almost every level from here on out, yeah, that's where your computer is tanking, okay? Because right now, let's look over here. You can't even see the particle effects, but there's a ton across that bridge. There's a ton right in front of me, and then if we look down, there's a bunch on those bridges as well, okay? And then on the far side, there's a couple of rooms filled with this stuff. And then once again, the fix, you know, for those to reiterate, because for some reason, you skipped around, go to video, or not video, <laughs> I'm doing it like a dozen times over, go to low, hit yes. And if you're lucky, you'll refresh. If not, let it pick up the screen, Alt-Tab, and then pop back in. If you do not want to Alt-Tab because Alt-Tabbing does something weird to your computer, then you can also reload the level. Now, reloading the level may be a bit safer, but I've tried reloading the, the level a couple times with sometimes it just not working. So, there's my recommendation. I hope this tutorial has helped you because 
Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Doom being played at 10 to 15 frames per second is obnoxious and in all due honesty is not how this game should be played. This is a game that should be played at maybe not full fidelity, but at least full speed. And I cannot say that this game is anything but full speed at 60 frames per second. 30 is okay, I guess. But we want full speed, which is about 60, give or take. So, yeah, that's how you fix it. I wish you guys the best of luck. And uh, stay safe, stay well. Later, everybody. I got some demon ass to go kick. Yeah, that shield don't matter when I bust you that hard, does it? Bitch. Fucking hate that. Okay. I need to go blow something up. Or something to blow up. There's a lot to blow up over there. Oh, I'm on fire.